Before Victoria begins training, she'll spend the day with the family, observing their issues. Come here! When I first rang the doorbell, I heard lots of barks. And then the door opened, and it was madness. Hello. Oh, my gosh. Charlotte started fighting with Henry. The couple was trying to keep the dogs back, but they couldn't keep the dogs back. The dogs flew out of the door. The trees fell everywhere. The dogs ran around the porch. I got nearly got knocked over. It was probably the most insane greeting I've ever had. Hi. Hello. Come on. Come on, guys. That was a greeting and a half. Isn't it, though? Come on in and grab a seat before they take it from you. OK. When I finally managed to get in and sit down, the dogs were either fighting over me or fighting with each other and, and then playing and then licking and slobbering and trying to get on the sofa. And it was very difficult to have a conversation with all of them being there. <laughs> oh, gosh. Not a lot of dogs nibble at your ear. But, but, but he is gentle. Yeah. Right. He's very gentle. It's like this. Ooh. He's the gentle one. Henry is not gentle. When he nips, it's not cute and it's not funny and it's not gentle. OK. Let me talk about your situation at home. When I came through that door... Oh, my gosh! What's happening is you've got three dogs, all very excited, redirecting all their excitement and frustration on each other. OK. Hi there. Hi. <laughs> it is an accident waiting to happen. I hope you've got great homeowner's insurance, because you're in for a lawsuit. Mm. Like that. Back at the house, Victoria wants to address the dog's outrageous greeting behavior. Oh, hi. Oh, my God. Hi, guys. Okay. I want to give the dogs a ritual of behavior. And I want to do a ritual for you that you can use with guests that is going to be a little time consuming to begin with, but is going to become a habit and is going to keep your guests safe. I had a friend that the dogs know but have nipped before come to the door. Just get up calmly, take them all into the bedroom. The goal of this training is that when the dogs hear the doorbell, instead of rushing to the door, they go to the safe place, which is the bedroom, and everybody can be more relaxed. Hi, Sandy. OK, and I want you to have this magazine just to look at. I wanted Josh to bring Henry up first to greet the guest, because Henry is the most problematic. So I wanted him to see guests coming in as a good thing rather than a bad thing. Now. If you go and get, take Henry back into the room and bring Jackson and, and Charlotte out. Oh, dear. Charlotte jumps on you, stand up and ignore. Each time Charlotte jumped up on Sandy, the guest, Sandy stood up and just ignored her so that she was boring for Charlotte. And eventually, Charlotte just walked away. Now they've lost interest, Josh, you let Henry out again. If the dogs come up to the guest and they're crowding the guest, Ashley and Josh can get up, put their bodies between the dogs and the guest, and tell the dogs to back up. Get back. Try back. not to physically touch the dogs, just tell them to back. back. Good. Well, it was a whole lot better coming in the house and not having the dogs all up under you, so it was much more pleasant to be able to come in and visit. I want you to take back your space. Right. It's just 100% better than what we've been doing. The result was fantastic. So it's, I, I'd be more than happy to do it, whatever it takes. The whole ritual is just basically not allowing the dogs to get to the crazy level. It's all calm. The couple has a friend come over to work on the greeting routine. While Josh removes the dogs, Ashley gets their guests settled. Hey, Come on, Amber. How are you, Jennifer? Hey, we'll have to have hey, you sit right here. She needs a magazine. Oh, gosh. I have faith. Back. Gosh. Yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect. Hey, Henry. Oh, he's being so good. Good boy. So now he's comfortable. That's awesome. It worked. So I'm going to let the other two out now. OK, OK, sounds good. Encouraged by Henry's calm behavior, 
the couple allows him to stay while Charlotte and Jackson are let out. Back. Back. Coats in her face. Good boy. That's good. After just a few moments, all the dogs lose interest. There we go. Yeah, it works. Fantastic. I didn't get slobbered on near as much this time as I had in the past, so it was a much more enjoyable visit with them this time. Victoria is returning to Ashley and Josh's home to follow up on where they've gone wrong in her absence. Hey, hi, hello, hi. How are you? Fine, thank you. Come on in. Hi, How are you? Oh, gosh, it's so nice to be able to walk in. <laughs> Space. It was so nice to walk through that door and not be jumped on or mauled by all of the dogs. 